Hamilton again now delivers the second corner and the ball is in the back of the net Blackburn Rovers are ahead within a couple of minutes by York strike partner Andy Cole on the bench along with uh, Matt Janssen the big name strikers on the bench of Blackburn Rovers as Ricketts has just got ahead this time of Andy Todd Michael Ricketts ball in the middle this is Janino this is the equaliser Half an hour played and Janino has levelled it up for Middlesbrough. And it was a wonderful, wonderful run by Michael Ricketts. It was a good turn, a good ball. And look at the supporters from Teesside. They go wild. Brad Friedel's goal is breached. And Janino, after half an hour, has put, made things level. Excellent ball. I thought Ricketts has delayed the pass too long, but in the end it was a fantastic pass. Good little chip by Janino. Probably Janine has been our worst player, I think, in this half so far, but he's done the business here and equalised. Opportunity now at the other end with Janino. Mendieta is the player forward. Janino opting to go alone. Had a shot! Oh, what a goal! Janino has put Middlesbrough 2 1 ahead. It's his second goal of the match. It's his fourth goal of the season. And with the second half just five minutes old, Borough are ahead at Ewood Park. Well, I've been giving Janini a little bit of stick, but can't give him any stick for that because excellent goal. He came inside and just curled it into the bottom corner. Excellent goal. Well, Brad Friedel beaten low to his right hand side. Borough ahead after 50 minutes. And Janino, who by his own very high standards has perhaps not had the best two games, is on the score sheet twice, though. What a finish. Just curl it around the goalkeeper. You'd have to question the fullback. You know, the fullback let him come inside. Should always push him to the outside in situations like that. Then. If this ball falls to a red shirt, it could be curtains for Blackburn. Friedel comes in and they've equalised. Well, oh, Blackburn Rovers have equalised at the death. Well, they put so much pressure on the Middlesbrough goal, and it seems that having the goalkeeper forward worked as well. Free headers Babel again, I think they'll achieve them. Marcus Babel scored his second goal. Brad Friedel did enough. And they've done it in injury time. It's a late, late equaliser for Blackburn Rovers. They've had so much pressure, and there we see it. Two free men, I see them in the, in the six yard box, too.